Oh, by the way, you know it's Aza Samira's birthday today? Yes, because I needed to tell every single one of you that. That's very important. Don't crash today! Please don't crash today. What's up, peeps? It's Santa Food, and I don't know about you, but I'm excited today. I'm excited because the goat's not on the pole. He's starting third. Not good enough. It's the Daytona 500. It's the first race of the 2017 T.O. Mike Memorial Cup Series. I keep forgetting to add NASCAR, but does it really matter? Yes. That was a stupid question. Let's take a look one more time through your lineup for this season and the cars they drive and stuff. On the pole today we have James Saunders driving the... No, who cares. Starting next to him is Aza Samir. Row 2, the GOAT, and Tibi Kiganaha. Row 3, Ryan Monaco and N Nicholas Bees. A.S. I, I, I was really counting on you to comment and uh, tell me how to pronounce that correctly. Row 4, Isaiah Monaco, the defending champion, and Ryan Lewis. Row 5, Tory Hamill and Bob Smith. Row 6, Zachary Taylor and Ryan Herman. Nah, who cares about the rows? Let's just go. Jeff Lewis and Chip McGee. Adam Lewis and Alan Walker. Silva Saibiki and Eric Monica. Someone... Oh. Did I mention how, how nice it is today in Las Vegas? It's cloudy and windy. Well, I guess you could say overcast. Yes, I'm recording. Okay, bye. Yeah. Okay. I hate it when she does that. I hate it when she does that. Okay. We got Sanaki Altina. I can't. Re I, I really can't believe it. And Yuki Nagato. I can't believe that either. What is this? Who are you people? Why are you signed up with these dumb names? We got Yuki Hagiwara. Can live with that. And Reggie fills it. I'm gonna stop breathing into the mic now. We got Taylor Bryan Price and Patrick Smith, Michael Pedersen and I Hidaka, Derek Hamill, and Kurt. Kurt I wanted to say Kurt von Bartelaven because he's a famous chess player from over a century ago, but it's Konstantin von Bartelaven. Close enough. We got Chai Sadagi, that's how I'm gonna say it. Chai Sadagi, deal with it! And NASCAR. Really? John Tron and Tito Peters. Alexander Cornish and Daniel Voilers. Bob and Flobo and Zach Mills. Shinayuki Takahashi and Kanan Matsuda. And running out the field is Takemi Fujiwara and Rupert Weiss Mueller. So without any further hesitation, I've just wasted about three minutes of your life running over the order for this race. Let's just. Let's just go. No restrictor plates on. Bandicam is going to cover up the speeds. But since I can see the speeds while recording, because there's no watermark during recording, I'm going to tell you the speeds. You're just going to have to believe me. Believe me. These guys look ready to go. Very excited. Pace car heads in. Look at the crowd. They're a bunch of mips and crap. I don't know. Free flag is on the way. It's the first lap of the 2017 T.O. Mike Memorial Cup Series. And that's a brilliant start from James Saunders. I can't say the same about other seven years. Maybe kind of has the shifting or something. I have no idea. Look, there's the goat. 
Ricky takes second place. You can see it's already three wide near the back, near the middle part of the field or something. That is a brilliant run from James Saunders. Lead us race. Here comes Nicholas Bees. Tabi Kigana has inside down the back straight. It's turn three. A few sparks from the goat's car. Actually, more sparks in the goat's car. Tons of sparks in the goat's car. Nicholas Bay is trying to get behind. He's going to file in. James Saunders to lead the first lap of the Daytona 500. Let's take a look at the action near the back of the field here. It's three wide with, uh, well, I can't, I'm going to have to remember this. Adam Lewis, Eric Monaco, and Aza Samir, who's fallen back quite a bit here. Alan Walker trying to get by on the inside down the back straight here. There's uh, Jeff Lewis, Zachary Taylor, Bob Smith, Yuki Hagiwara. They're making it three wide for a bit. Three wide for a bit? That doesn't make sense. By the time I remember what these names are, I'm going to forget what they are because I keep getting confused with uh, the previous season's drivers. Lots of two wide racing there. You see uh, Michael Patterson running on the high side and near the back of the field. Wow, these guys near the back have really spaced out. Last place is Zach Mills. 39th is Takumi Fujiwara. Yeah, I don't think switching from the 77 was any help to you. Look, the 77 is now still riding third place. We're going to have to take a look at your order after James Saunders leads lap four of this race. It's James Saunders, of course, in the lead behind him, the GOAT. Nicholas Bees in third, Hibiki Ganaha fourth, and Isaiah Monaco, your defending champion, fifth. Ryan Monaco sixth, Tori Hamill seventh, Chip McGee eighth, Eric Monaco ninth, and Adam Lewis tenth. You see those two fighting for the ninth position. Zachary Taylor watching comfortably from behind. He's going to push Adam Lewis past Eric Monaco down the back straight here and take tenth position for himself while pushing Lewis into ninth. Let's we'll see if he does it. Eric Monaco is running the high side. Here comes Alan Walker. Files in behind him, but uh, overtakes of the week. And uh, good sportsmanship from Zachary Taylor as he pushes his way into 10th. Adam Lewis looking to make a move on Chip McGee into turn one. Again, getting a push from Zachary Taylor. Eric Monaco and Alan Walker will give him some help. Now you see Ryan Lewis in the background. Overtakes of the week, but now Adam Lewis heads to the outside line. And it's Zachary Taylor to the inside, down the back straight. Into turn one, not turn one, three. Out of turn four, Adam Lewis has fallen behind significantly. Here come Bobby Smith, Ryan Herman, and Jeff Lewis. Large line, shifting all over the place as well. These guys are a bit more spread out. It's still Nicholas B is riding closely behind the goats. Isaiah Monica looks to have taken fifth place from Hibiki Gana while we weren't paying attention. I've got the house to myself so I can scream as much as I want. B still trying to make a move on the inside of Goat, still trying to defend that position. Nicholas Saunders leads yet another lap here. We're nearing the halfway point of the Daytona 500. Bees runs to the outside. Still sparks flying from the Goat. He's bottoming out all over the show. Two hundred fifty miles an hour, two hundred fifty-two from the goats, two fifty-three from James Saunders back to two fifty heading into this turn here. Takumi Fujiwara, Yuki Hagiwara, Sanaki Altina in the pits. Don't know what that's about. Here come James Saunders, Nicholas B, Isaiah Monaco, uh Ibiki Ganhan, Ryan Monaco into the pits. A few cars staying out. I'm going to have to remember them. Oh dear. I'll probably forget, knowing me. I think I will forget. Here's hoping that James Saunders can get a fast pit stop. Here comes Aza Samir into the pits. Right behind. James Saunders gets out. Nicholas B is heading in right behind. Isaiah Monaco, oh, nearly beating him to the line there. I think he did beat him to the line, in fact. Hibiki Ganaha and Ryan Monica side by side here. Here comes the GOAT. Pass these cars to lap them and lead that lap. Lap them and lead that lap. 
We're gonna take a look at your fastest laps here. Ryan Monaco has posted the fastest one today, 35.687 seconds. Nicholas Bees and Isaiah Monica right behind. Then it's James Saunders, the guy who was leading most of the first part of the race. He became kind of high and finally the GOAT. Then Jeff Lewis, um, Rupert Weissmuller, I think. Uh, Ryan Herman. Ryan Herman. I think it's Ryan Herman. And Tori Hamill. Yeah, Ryan Herman. And Rupert Weissmuller. I got those rights! I'm so awesome! Ghost running out of fuel here, as you can see. Isaiah Monaco is taking a. taking a. um. I don't know, this position from James Son, as you can see. Nicholas B is falling behind them quite a bit. James Son is looking very aggressive on the defending champion's backside. I'm going to keep calling the defending champion. He comes to the inside, down the back straight. I'm sure it's called like a. I'm sure it has a special name at Daytona. Goat slowing down. He's going to head into the pits. Probably lose a lot of time there while he's at it. And that's James Saunders taking the position cleanly from Isaiah Monica. Overtakes of the week. We're going to ride on board of Ryan Monica here. Let's see what position he has. Third position. No, second, because the goats headed into the, headed into the pits. See the go exiting pit lane in the background here. James Saunders and Isaiah Monica flying by him. Where is Nicholas Bayes? Bees, Bayes, who knows? Zach Mills is left and go going a bit slow. It's three wide with Tori Hamill, Ryan Monica, and Hibiki Ganahad are trying to get by him. He's going a bit slow down the back straight, trying to conserve you. A bit of contact with Hibiki Ganahad to turn three. Eric Monica has appeared out of nowhere and is getting by Tori Hamill. It's turns three and four. Sparks flying from the goats. He files in behind Hibiki Ganaha. I think you know what's happen gonna happen. Caution's out! Isaiah Monica's in the wall! He's been back to by Zach Mills and he's flipping furiously. The goat goes spinning! Hibiki Ganaha goes spinning! The goat is flipping in the grass outside of pit lane! Caution is out! And that is a horrible crash. See the ambulances in the background go immediately getting towed. Isaiah Monaco as well. We're going to have to take a replay of that. We were riding on board of Isaiah Monaco. You're defending champion for quite a bit, and it looks like this is going to be a premature end to this day. You see Daniel Voile's slow car. They're a bit of contact with them. They go both go into the wall. Isaiah Monaco goes spinning, and here comes Zach Mills, a lapped car. He can't see him through the smoke until it's too late. He piles right into him. Sends Isaiah Monica flipping in the background here. Meanwhile, Hibiki kind of went into the wall and sent the goat spinning into the grass. You see these cars slowing down. And, uh, let's right on board with the goat. Watch what happened from his perspective. That engine's gone. You see the spin up ahead. These cars trying to slow down for Hibiki kind of slows. The goat piles into her. She goes into the wall. And he goes flipping. We have to take a look at the uh, incident one more time here with Isaiah Monica. Maybe we get a better angle on it. That is the scariest thing you could see. That's Isaiah Monica's day over. Very disappointing. Again, for the defending champion. Ganaha still trying to get back onto this track. I think she'll be okay to continue. I can't say the same. Definitely, surely not about the GOAT here. Car's getting a bit bunched up here. Derek Camel into Tito Peters' backside. Ganaha goes spinning again with a bit of contact with uh, NASCAR there. Car's getting past the pace car while they're at it. So it seems that James Saunders is still leading the field. Tori Hamill right behind. There's Nick Bees 
filing in as well, and Ryan Monaco as well, I believe. Daniel Voile is heading into the pits, so I guess that wasn't Tori Hamlin. What the hell am I smoking this time? A few cars into the pits, not least of which, which uh, Hibiki Ganha and Yukio Hakiwara, I believe. Takumi Fujiwara has been stuck on pit road. You see him up there. He's exiting with no hood. Zach Mills with no bumper. Number zero, Bob and Flobo getting by. Alexander Cornish has been stuck in pit road as well. Daniel Boyle is still there. Oh, dear. It's gone from bad to worse for Hibiki Ganha. She's made contact with Aza Samir on pit road. Daniel Voile is finally exiting. And uh, there are, there's Bob Smith, who's also been stuck on pit road, and Isaiah Monaco. Stuck on pit road. Nearing the end of this race already. Might even end on a caution. Nope, lights out on the pace car when we go back to green. Field will be led by James Saunders, Nick Bees, Ryan Monaco, Patrick Smith, Yuki Nagato, Tori Hamill, John Tron, Eric Monaco, Rupert Weissmuller, and Alan Walker in the top 10. We restart here at Daytona. Four laps to go. Ryan Monaco immediately to the outside line, trying to get past Nick Bees through there. It's going to take a lot of doing to get back up to the racing speed we're seeing earlier. 250 miles an hour down the back straight and heading into turn three. Ryan Monaco is definitely taking that position from Nick Bees. You see uh, Patrick Smith on the outside line there. James Son is his teammate. He's just lost a load, loads of positions, really. That's, uh, that's some poor driving from him. Uh, Hidaka gets by. Ryan Lewis looking aggressive on Rupert Weiss Mueller's backside. Eric Monaco trying to get past Tori Hamill. Probably Yuki Nagato past Nick Bees. James Saunders to come and lead another lap. Three more to go. Yuki Nagata's on the apron. No idea what that's about. And it's a caution! No idea what this was sparked by, but is is this what? Boss. Something in the background. Car flip there! It's uh, oh crap. Who is it? Alexander Cornish! This must have been on the restart or something. No, not the, not the re okay. Um there's a lot of explaining to do. It's the big one at Daytona, and I have no idea what's gone on. We're gonna have to do some investigations. Invest, investi investigations, investigations. Okay, well, let's see. I believe it starts innocently enough with John Tron. Bit of contact with Tito Peters. They go spinning. Konstantin von Bartolov gets collected. I don't know what happened to Shidayuki Takahashi. Just got loose and spun into the wall. Alexander Cornish spun into the wall as well. Jeff Lewis was involved. Bob and Flobo turned around as well. Daniel Voile has collected in another accident. And, uh... Takemi Fujiwara involved as well. We're gonna have to take a look at that once more. We really don't have a choice, and... We still we still gotta make this a 20-minute video, because Dems to Bricks. <laughs> you see Jeff Lewis getting, getting by. I think Kana Matsuda escaped. Unscathed. A few cars collected there. It's right on board with Tito Peters. Really hoping to make a good debut in NASCAR, and uh, that's not what he had in mind. I'm going to see if Kana Matsuda makes it through this. I think she did without any damage. Let's do one more thing here and ride on board with Alexander Cornish. You see his 
camera's gone because he's upside down. You gotta pay attention up here. See, here's Shiryu Takahashi. He's going to spin later on and send him into the wall. I think it's her fault. Nah, he just got loose and spun into her. Oh dear. Another teammate of uh, James Saunders having a bad day. Patrick Smith involved as well. Patrick Smith hoping not to crash out in the first race of this season. But uh, we know Patrick Smith can't escape crashes. It's just not in his capacity. Go back to the action here. I do believe that that means James Saunders is going to. He's in the. He's on the apron. There's Shiryuki Takahashi. He's heading into the pits. This is uh strange at best, and he's lost a few positions there. Who's in the lead now? It's seems to be Nick Bees. Is it Nick Bees? It's probably Nick Bees. Bayus. Bayus. No idea. It is. I don't know what, what happened with James Saunders there, but he's just blown his chances of winning. The white flag is out. Under the caution. Pace car is going to lead the field to the checkered flag here at Daytona. It was a crazy day, as one might have expected. Many uh, people just having a... I don't know. Getting crashed off. It's not a good. It's not a good way to start the season, but that's Daytona for you. It's going to be Nick Beers to win the Daytona 500 under caution. He had the fastest time in practice. Only qualified fifth, but again had the fastest time in pa practice here, as you can see. So that is the race over. Nicholas Bees wins at Daytona. That's a lot of money, man. That doesn't exist in this game, unfortunately. Tori Hamill second. That's probably the best she'll, she's ever finished. Rupert Weissmuller third. Amazing debut. Ryan Lewis fourth. Switching teams might have, you know, helped him out a bit. I don't know. Maybe he'll have a better chance, an even better chance than he did last time. Fifth place, Ai Hidakia. Another brilliant debut. Taylor Bryan Price sixth. And he, let me guess he did better than Derek Hamill. Yeah, Derek Hamill's in 11th. Zachary Taylor, 7th. The F1, the F1 star has shown his worth here in NASCAR today. 22, NASCAR is 8th. Still a dumb name, man. Derek Hamill, 9th. Yeah. Michael Patterson, 10th. Great debut. Ryan Herman, 11th. Great debut. Yuki Hagiwara, 12th. Nice. Ryan Monica, 13th. What we expected. Eric Monica, 14th. Much of the same. Chip McGee. Great debut, 15th. James Saunders, 16th. We could have won it. Yuki Nagato, 17th. Great debut. John Tron, 18th. Great debut. He's a lap down, by the way. Aza Samir, 19th. Two laps down. Good enough. Let's. And here's everybody who's crashed out or been stuck on pit road. Let's uh, play some sad music or something. Reggie Philzame, Alan Walker, Patrick Smith, Tito Peters, Constantine von Bartleben, Shideyuki Takahashi, Takemi Fujiwara, Daniel Volos, Hibiki Ganaha, Bob and Flobo, Alexander Cornish, Chiaik Sadagi, Bobby Smith, Sanaki Altina, Tsubasa Ibiki, Isaiah Monaco, The Goat. Ah, who cares about him? Jeff Lewis, Zach Mills, and Kana Matsuda, and finishing last today, Adam Lewis. Ain't war hell! Nicholas Bees ekes out a win at Daytona. He drove hard today. Next race, Atlanta, which is actually Hampton, Georgia. Here's your point standings, as you can see. You're supposed to have 185 points. What is this? Oh, okay, whatever. And, of course, your uh, point standings for today. Pretty much your finishing results from Daytona. Look at all these DNFs. Nicholas B has only let three laps. And he won. Leading laps is and everything, I guess. Anyways, it's been Hanafuda. It's been a time and a half in honor. And I will see you in the next video.